Oh yeah, it is Club Paris here at ET. <laughs> Paris Hilton, everybody, on the ones and twos. Yeah, we're turning up the heat in here today, and thank you so much to Paris Hilton for joining us and showing us the new scenes from her music video, Come Alive. It drops on iTunes today. Congratulations. Thank you. Good to have you here. All right, I gotta say, I love the whole fantasy thing that she has going on. I mean, particularly the hair. You got some hair going on. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Big hair, I mean, big time. And you also got a unicorn under. What's up with the unicorn? It is. I want it to be very magical. The song is a love song. It's a very fantasy world and I want it to be very special and different. Now some of the lyrics uh, you know we're hearing may have been inspired by that uh, hot Spanish model you're with or, or was it somebody else? Um, it's just about love in general. I think you know when you're in love it's just like this magical feeling that makes you feel alive and that's what I wanted the song to be about. Are you saying you're in love? I think the song is about love. So. Oh, I think she's looking like she's in love, Rob. It's the summer of love. Oh, there you go. <laughs> I love. think that would be an affirmative. All right, well, some people might not know this, but actually Paris is one of the top DJs in the world. And I know that you have another big residency coming up in Ibiza. Yeah, it's so much fun. And I'm so excited to be playing there for a second year in a row. I'm playing every single Wednesday night, playing for 10,000 people. It's so exciting to be up there. and. Um, I love it. You have such a huge international following, some of that driven by, by social media. Mm -hmm. uh, Taylor Swift uh, wrote an op-ed in the Wall Street Journal saying that, you know, autographs are out. Everybody wants a selfie. Do you agree with that? Does everybody want a selfie with you? Oh yeah, I completely agree with that. I think it's definitely the autograph of the 21st century. It's what everyone wants. It's either to be followed on Twitter or to have a selfie. Yeah, it is the big thing. We also got some hot topics that we were going over and we were talking about earlier in the show. You ready to weigh in on them? Yes. All right, here we go. Sofia Vergara and Joe Manganiello, so Joe, as we like to call them and have now nicknamed them. So we asked our ET Facebook community, who is hotter, so Joe or the newly hooked up JLo and Maxim? As of right now, 60% of you chose so Joe. Who do you like, Paris? I agree with the viewers. So yeah. Joe is cute together. Like Sofia Vergara? Yeah, I love her. She's so sweet. So another topic that's blowing up on social media, and I'm sure you get asked about this a lot because the two of you have known each other so long, Kim Kardashian. On CNBC just today, she said something that kind of alludes to the fact that she may be slowing down. There's so many times when I just didn't want to get up and work on something, and I just wanted to be home with my baby. You kind of slowed down for a little bit, and, and then you kind of blew up internationally. Do you think that's a smart play for her? I think, you know, she just had a baby, she just got married, so I think she's focusing more on family, and I think family is what's most important. You know, this is our job and what we do, and it's a lot of fun, but I think when you're in love and you have a beautiful child, that it's more important to be at home with them. She should pull back on the publicity a little bit? I think, you know, she's a businesswoman, she's doing what she wants, she's a mother, so I think doing both. Okay, back to your song being released today. You've had hits before, what's gonna make this one a hit? The song is just so beautiful, so much fun, and, is really catchy. Thanks so much for being here today. Yeah, congrats. Thanks.